today we are going to film Leia's four month update. I'm a little bit late and I apologize about all the lack of videos from last week. We're all very sick. Um, we had stuffy noses and just a whole shebang. So, but we're all better now, huh Leia? She's got her cute little Halloween sweater on, her little Halloween hoodie. Yeah, you look so super stylish. Um, so she is four months old. I don't have anything written down for this video, so I'm going to have to go off the top of my head. Um, the first big thing for this month is that she has started sitting up. If you guys haven't already seen the pictures on Facebook, she can sit up for short periods of time, but we definitely still have to put pillows around her so that she... When she flops over, she falls on something soft, <laughs> of course. So I'm really, really surprised at how early she started sitting up. Um, I think she sat up a little earlier than Olivia did. She sat up at three and a half months. So good job, Leia. That was really, really early. <laughs> I'm telling you though, I am just like hoping that she's not going to be like an early crawler or anything because it's so nice just being able to put them there and know that they're gonna stay there and not just go get hurt or destroy things. I'm really enjoying this baby time. And I really just want Leia to stay a baby because she's such a good little baby. She started laughing a lot more, like cracking up type of laughing, just like really getting hysterical about things. Um, she's very ticklish and she is just, she's just got a great sense of humor. She's still a very easy baby, but we have been having some trouble with the nights <clears throat> the past I want to say months, maybe three weeks. She was sleeping actually really good when she was sick. It was really nice actually when she was sick. She just basically slept and then fed and then went right back to sleep. She slept basically like a whole 24 hours pretty much when she was sick, which is exactly what you're supposed to do when you're sick. So she's very, very smart and she handled it like a champ. Like when she was awake, she was just smiling and just super happy and just acting normal. Bless you! See, she's getting the mucus out now. <laughs> Do you like sneezing? She always smiles after she sneezes. It's so cute. She's waking up every two to three hours, and at first I thought it was just a growing spurt, but she's not even really just waking up to nurse. She's either waking up to start talking, like she'll just sit there, and she makes kind of like these bird sounds. Like she goes like, ah! like all night long. <laughs> then she'll get fussy and then she'll want the boob to soothe and then she won't want the boob. She'll want to suck on her thumb because she's a thumb sucker. That's something I keep forgetting to mention in her updates. She can't decide if she wants to soothe with the boob or if she wants to soothe with the thumb. So she will go back and forth. Like I'll be sitting next to her and she'll be like, oh no, I want my thumb. Oh no, I want the boob. Oh no, I want my thumb. Oh no, I want the boob. And it gets so irritating for me and it can take a really long time to get her to wind back down. So I'm hoping it's just some kind of weird little phase that she's going through. Um, but yeah, um, I don't have too many stats, but I did have her appointment like three weeks ago, almost a month ago, um, on her weight and everything. And she was 12 and a half pounds and 20... Oh, I can't even remember the inches, but she was in the average range for height for her age. So she's in the 50th percentile. I'm guessing now she's probably bigger. You know, it's been almost a month since then. So, um, yeah, but she's doing really, really great on that front. The doctor was very, very happy with her head control and with her strength and with her sitting up already. Always looking at things on the ground. Oh, that's another thing. She started grabbing things. Um, like if I am giving her a toy, she'll start reaching for it. She doesn't quite have that, you know, grasping instinct quite down yet like where she'll do it just kind of all the time but if she really really wants something she'll reach for it and oftentimes she reaches for my face and um yeah she's so she's definitely getting along with things there she hasn't rolled over since that one time um she just doesn't really seem to see the need to roll over at the moment but i can't believe she's already heading towards the six month mark i hope you guys enjoyed you want to say bye 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 guys <laughs>